This morning, teachers from Stanford Public Schools District organized a walkout in protest of getting a sixth class with no pay. This is because of a national teacher shortage that is particularly prominent in Stanford with numerous vacancies across the district. With that in mind, the union organized a Teach the Contract Day where they walked into the building together holding signs to show that they are stronger together. Hi, I'm Jasmine Whitfield, Arts Editor of the Roundtable, and I'm here with... Mr. Gladstone. Mr. Gladstone, why are you here? I'm here because teachers here in Stanford are being asked to teach us an extra class for no extra pay, um, and we're already really overloaded. Um, and it's a real big change to our everyday work um, you know, schedule and our workload, and it's really an unfair burden that they put on teachers. Um, we're already extremely overworked, and we already have... Um, some of us already 130, 140 students. This would add another 30 students onto our workload for no additional pay. And really, um, it's an incredibly difficult thing to put on teachers and makes it very hard to bring in new teachers into the district. It does a lot of damage to our school district. Okay, thank you. Hi, I'm Jasmine Redfield here with- John Ringel. Why are you here? Well, you know, supporting the cause. I don't think um, we should, yeah, I don't think it'd be good overall if we had to do more work for less money. Why don't you want a sixth class? Because I think it'll just stretch us even thinner. I think the answer is to fund it better so we can hire the number of teachers we need to keep doing the same level of work that we have been doing, which is already stretched thin as it is. Okay, thank you. I'm here with Jessica Browner. Why are you here? Uh, I'm here because teachers have a really hard job and we put in a lot of time outside of the classroom working and asking teachers to take on another teaching period is untenable. It's not even just about work-life balance, it's just about getting everything done during work. Um, the amount of time spent outside of the classroom grading, prepping, attending meetings, writing reports is, is the invisible part of teaching that people don't see and it's incredibly time consuming and exhausting. Thank you. I'm here with Mr. Lopez. Why are you here? Um, because for a teacher like me, who is the fourth to last hire in their department, if we have six out of eight classes, that can mean people like me actually get fired or, or let go because there aren't enough classes to kind of go around. And so you're basically going to lose some good teachers. I think I'm a good teacher, but I think so too. thank you. So that's why I'm here, because honestly, I mean, we do a lot during the day um, from helping kids with um, college essays to tutoring to all the other, not tutoring, but extra help, all of that other kind of stuff. I mean, to lose teachers at this time when we have a teacher shortage is kind of crazy. So for me, one, I don't want to lose my job because I love what I do. And two, it's just not fair to you guys to lose good teachers, especially now. I'm going to have to print time for my labs and we're cleaning up afterwards. Remember Angela Corona? If they want to give us a sixth class, pay us. <laughs>